What is going on guys, JT Gilly back with another video and the Quest system is live. It is one o'clock Friday, March 30th and the Quest systems have just come out and I'm very, very excited. Plus, I have an EX raid right now. You know what it is, I got an EX raid at the beginning of my quest. How, how else would you want to start off a quest than with an EX raid? So it's going to be awesome. Hopefully today I can get Mewtwo and Mew. That would be an awesome video. But we're going to go ahead and start it up here. I have yet to click on it. I was talking to some buddies over there and apparently Professor Willow talks. So I have my, my game sound on. And uh, let's go ahead and click on the quest for the first time ever. This is going to be awesome. Let me know how you guys feel about this quest system. Let's go. Let me know in the comments if you guys have completed your tasks. Alright, clicking on it. Uh, he's not, he's not really talking. <laughs> He's not saying anything, but it says, Official Jason Gilly, how are you? It's been a while, hasn't it? You've become quite the trainer. It's actually been like two years. Um, I haven't seen him since I started the game. So, thanks, man, for, like, now you want to, now you want to talk? After I've become, like, the most elite trainer? Anyways, um, so he doesn't talk, I guess. Maybe it's because I have my music off. Maybe he does talk. Uh, I can't even, uh, well, we're going to have to skip out on Professor Willow talking. I wanted to ask for your help. As you know, I study Pokemon and their habitats. I've learned a lot over the years, but recently, I found some hints of something mysterious. I was wondering if you would help me investigate what's going on. Sure, why not? You will, that's great. Wow, listen. Uh, first things first, let's calibrate my instruments to your area. Could you complete the tasks? Spend five stops easy, catch ten Pokemon easy. There's like five right here. Transfer five Pokemon. I have five Pokemon to transfer. I have that ready. Let's go. Let's try. All right, here we go. Here we go. We're here. All right, there's the quest system right there. We got the field ones. Okay, we can't do the field research yet. We got to visit more Pokestops to unlock those. Okay, we can start the mythical quest. Here we go. We got to get seven stamps. We have to complete seven tasks, and then we get a research break the breakthrough. And I believe when we do get that research breakthrough, our rewards will be a Great Ball, Incubator, and Lure Modules. And then after that, I'm assuming we have to do something else, and then we can get the opportunity to catch Mew, or if you guys haven't heard already, other legendary Pokemon. Now, Moltres has already been one that's been confirmed. Um, you can catch it with a Pokeball. You have regular raspberries. If you guys haven't seen the screenshot, I'll probably include it on the screen right there. But uh, there's Moltres in the game, so apparently Moltres is one of the Pokemon you can encounter in this quest system. I called that in the video because it said on the on the article it said, and you can even encounter legendary Pokemon. And if they were talking about Mew, they would have said mythical, but they didn't. So I knew we were gonna get some new Pokemon here. I'm assuming Shiny Moltres will also be available. Um, that just kind of makes sense. So let's go ahead and start this quest. We got about five or ten minutes until our EX race starts. Let's try to get a few tasks done okay so first off let's go ahead and spin that stop boom new field research we unlocked the field research and we added to our quest beautiful now our field research we unlocked catch three fire type Pokemon oh and the reward is oh okay I think I don't know if that's the reward like a new Pokemon appears I'm not sure what that reward is oh there's no fire type Pokemon around here <laughs> I am, it's going to be very hard to find a fire type Pokemon around here. Okay, we're going to have to find that. Regardless, let's go ahead and catch five Pokemon right off the bat right here. Unfortunately, I'd like my first one to be Mewtwo. Um, you know what? I'm going to let the first Pokemon I catch be Mewtwo because that's going to be an awesome start to my first ever quest in Pokemon Go. I cannot wait. I'm going to have Mewtwo be the first Pokemon I catch. Um, I have already spun a stop. Catch three fire type Pokemon. I got to do that. Um, spin five stops. Catch ten Pokemon. Transfer ten Pokemon. Let me do that. I can do that. I think I left five Pokemon to transfer. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Yep. Five Pokemon right there. Bada bing, bada boom. Goodbye. We completed a. We completed it. We claim that reward. 500 XP. So, if if the reward is on the right, then that has to mean that after I catch those three Fire type Pokemon, I get to encounter Pokemon. Now I don't know. Do you think that's Moltres? Catch three Fire type Pokemon and you encounter Moltres. That seems a little bit too easy. But you never know, man. All right, I gotta find a fire type nest or something. Uh, what fire type Pokemon are in raids right now? Oh, I can't remember. I can't remember any off the top of my head, dude. Ah, what fire type Pokemon are in raids right now? I don't know, but I'm gonna keep on looking on my nearby, and if I ever see a fire type Pokemon, I'm gonna fly for it. Um, let's go ahead and start this Mewtwo raid and get started on this first quest ever in Pokemon Go. Let me know if you guys are hyped. Make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe if you guys haven't already. Today's gonna be a great day. Mystic Seven's gonna meet up with us in a little bit. It's gonna be awesome. Mewtwo to start it off. Let's go do our EX raid. All right, you guys, really quick, um, I forgot. I can spin more stops to unlock more field research. So let's let's go ahead and spin the stop that Mewtwo is on right now. There's Mewtwo, awesome. Let's go ahead and get it. 49,430 CP. Let's spin this and unlock a new field research. Okay, we got a free raid pass and we can un unlock a new thing. It also goes towards our other research. I'm sorry that I had the hella had the camera down. Um visit Pokestops to find I just spun it! Oh, I guess they're not gonna count that as a Pokestop. Okay, Shani, ah, 
All right, so we are, uh, we're about to start the EX raid in about four minutes here, so I'm super excited. I'm not catching anything because I want me to, to be my first catch of the day. Now, hopefully, we can start the EX raid. All right, and here we go. We're gonna start today's quest off with an EX raid. I gotta pop a lucky egg. Gotta pop a star piece, you know what it is. It's gonna be my my uh, something day streak. I'm not exactly sure. We're gonna go ahead and hop in. And there's a torch right here so we can get one fire type catch right out of the way. That'll be nice. Let's throw in that EX raid. I didn't get the EX raid for next week, so I got a little bit of a break, which I do like. Um, it's hard having a, being busy on every Friday. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and hop in. 75 seconds left, we got 11 people. Three instinct players, okay. I'm excited. 50 seconds left, EX Raid, let's do it. Three, two, and one. We're gonna go ahead and hop in. This is the best angle I got. I hope you guys, hope it's okay for you guys. All right, we're gonna hop in Mewtwo right here. Oh, it's partly cloudy. Wait, is it gonna be boosted? Oh no, my, God, my camera. <laughs> is it gonna be boosted? It's cloudy. Wait, what What boost? Oh no, I think it has to be uh, something else. I don't, I don't know what the weather is. I hope it's, hope it's cloudy, because we can get a boosted Mewtwo for the first time ever. I don't even know the boosted Mewtwo CP, so that's kind of going to suck. That's going to make me really, really scared, and I'm going to find out at the end. But hopefully we can take it down. i got to hold this camera for a sec. got to tighten it up, but i got to get as much damage as possible. It's more important that we get more damage and more balls against Mewtwo than if the camera falls. Hopefully the camera stays stay still um I, I don't know why i'm drawing a blink right now i i think windy weather boosts psychic type pokemon i could be wrong I'm, oh i think it's it's not windy this is cloudy i'm okay i'm an idiot sorry i wish it was windy weather outside but it's not it really never is out here in uh, in the bay area it's always cloudy or sunny that's really it's really it we don't get windy weather a ton but it's all good oh we got mewtwo going in against mewtwo probably this is my worst mewtwo so i guess it's probably not the best thing to use oh this mewtwo has hyper beam we're fine yeah he's not gonna do much damage at all He's not gonna do much damage at all as he just destroys my Mewtwo. I'm gonna tap as fast as I can. Let me get these charge moves off because I gotta get as many, as much damage as possible at least. We got 14 people in here we worked with. Three instinct members. I gotta crunch off, I gotta crunch off. Let me do more damage. Let's go, down goes Mewtwo. Alrighty, all right, come on. 22.75. That's my worst one, 22.13. 22-13 Mewtwo right there. Nine balls. I like that. Can we get a shiny? No. That would have been... <laughs> I know I know it's not in the game, but you never know. You never know. All right. 22-13 Mewtwo right here. Not the greatest, but I'll definitely take the candy, and I'll take another Mewtwo. This will be Mewtwo number four for me. All right. We got nine balls. We should be okay. He just keeps jumping. I don't know what... I don't know. Boom! That was a great... Huh? Okay. One... Mmm, that was not a great. I'll tell you that right now. That was not a great. Let me fix the camera. Nice. Okay, the camera's not gonna go anywhere now. Let me reset that circle. That's a small circle. If I hit this, if I hit this, you know it's real. Boom! Look at that from downtown. And a foul. Two? Nope. Okay. I don't know if that was two or one. That was a great throw. I'm not gonna lie. And I fade away. All right. That's also a pretty small circle, but I'll be fine. I feel like I'm gonna slip on this one. Right? Okay. <laughs> I thought I was going to slip. I got a little nervous for that one. Dude, it hasn't even spun twice yet. Okay. A little tough. We're three balls in. We've thrown pretty good balls. I'm not even going to lie. Okay, I guess I got to get smaller for him. How small do you want it, dude? I almost dropped that. That's a small one. If I hit this, if I hit this, that's crazy. Oh, oh that's on me. That's on me. That's my fault. No. <laughs> I thought I was going to get on that one. Dude, sometimes I get it on the worst throws. I really do. Okay. All right. That's pretty small. That's actually might be too small. Hopefully, I can hit it. Five balls left. Boom. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. One. Sun is blaring on my back as we get another excellent. That's two in a row. One. Let's go. I just critical caught a Mewtwo. <laughs> what? Oh my god. <laughs> Yo. Oh my god. We just critical caught a Mewtwo. This is gonna be a this is gonna be a great day. Let's go ahead and catch this Torchic. Make it one of the three fire type Pokemon we need to get. Okay, come on. I just critical caught a Mewtwo. I can't catch this Torchic. One fire type Pokemon caught. Torchic caught. Horrible IVs, transfer, nice. 
Let's get him out of here. Let's go and continue the quest. Oh, let's go spin this last stop. We spin this stop. We spin this stop one more time, and we finish another task. All right, here we are. We've arrived at the next Pokestop. stop. Let me spin that, and boom, completed another task. Let me claim that reward real quick. I don't know if we got double XP. We're gonna find out in a second, but now we gotta catch 10 Pokemon and complete that, and then we get the rewards. So let's go ahead and catch them now. All right, this next little sequence of events is gonna be pretty cool. So I want to make sure I get this on camera. By the way, it is hot as hell. Um, it's like 87 degrees right now, uh, which is really, really hot for the bay because it's been kind of cold recently. Um, so it's been super hot. So if I start sweating, excuse me, but uh, we got all right. We got get caught. 10, po 10 Pokemon right there. So we claim that reward, and then we claim this reward, which we get an incubator, three lures, and 10 gray balls, which I really do like. And you get it in this screen, which is so cool. Like, that looks so amazing. Great job, Niantic. So I gotta earn two candies while walking my buddy, which I need to go switch my buddy to like a Whalmer, uh, make 10 great throws, and then hatch three eggs. Let me go do all of that. And then while we're doing that, that's all gonna happen really in the background. Uh, I'm gonna catch Pokemon and whatnot, but I'm gonna go battle a gym and I'm gonna go look for another fire type Pokemon. Let me make Whalmer my buddy type Pokemon just so I can get two free candies off of it. Bag on, I've walked with you for 108 kilometers. I appreciate you being here, but we're gonna have to move on. Let's go ahead and get Whalmer to walk with us. I'm assuming it only takes one kilometer with him, right? Uh, yes, it does. Okay, so I gotta go walk him for two kilometers. I'm gonna drive around a little bit and uh, probably battle down a gym. Hopefully find another type, another, another fire type Pokemon. I don't know why it's cloudy weather because it's hot as hell, but uh, hopefully we can get all of our tasks done because that's what we need right now. Okay, we got a couple of things we could do here. Right now, we're gonna try to go for greats. This is our third fire type Pokemon. So after this, we get our first ever Pokemon encounter in the quest system. Hopefully, it'll be a good Pokemon. There's chances it could be a Moltres. I've seen someone get a Jinx. Um, okay, we got the catch three fire type Pokemon. We were okay, so we were talking about it. Uh, me and my me and my my Discord group, and we we're talking about it, and it very well could be a Moltres. Um, three fire type Pokemon, you get a Pokemon encounter, it kind of makes sense. Let's go ahead and actually see what happens. Great, thanks, JT Gilly. Now I should be yada yada yada. Oh, we, we had this conversation. We had to, we just had this conversation, man. All right, let's claim this reward. What do you guys think it's gonna be? Before before I click on it, let me know in the comments what Pokemon you guys think is gonna be. I'll give you guys a second. All right, let's do it. What do you, if it's the Moltres, I'm gonna go nuts. I think it's gonna be just a random Pokemon. You can earn another stamp. Now, I didn't think it was gonna be a Moltres because that's way too easy, just catch three fire type Pokemon. But, look. Okay, okay. I think it's gonna be any Pokemon of that type, you know what I mean? So like, any Pokemon of that type, just a random one. Um, I'm sure there's gonna be like a certain pool of Pokemon that it's gonna be, choosen, be chosen from, we can figure that out, but uh, yeah. All right, so we gotta make six more great throws, hatch three eggs, get two candies while walking our buddy, and battle a gym. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, so I really quick I want to talk about something with the field research you can only get one stamp a day Now I'm assuming you can complete more tasks We can only get one stamp a day um, now for the special research you can do all of these in one day Now I don't know exactly how many times you can get all of these but you can do all of them in one day So that's pretty cool. Um, oh wow. There's eight pages Bro, I thought it was eight tasks. Jeez, man. That's gonna be a lot That's eight times three if I do my calculations correctly. That's 24 tasks this is gonna take all day. <laughs> okay, and we've actually gotten a good amount of progress since the last clip I recorded. I've caught a lot of Pokemon. I've gotten two new field researches, which were uh, catch three bug type Pokemon and catch 10 weather boosted Pokemon. And I actually think I've done a lot of them on the way here. I've been go plusing a lot, um, you know, and, and uh, getting some stuff done. So I wanna say I have completed one mythical task and then one field research task. Uh, from what I remember. I think someone else is battling down the gym with me, and then also another one that I need to do, the second one I ever got, is battle the gym five times. So we're gonna go ahead and battle these gyms down, hopefully we can take it out quickly, and we can complete some more tasks, man. I'm really excited. Uh, one thing also I wanna talk about, all that talk about Moltres earlier, just totally disregard that. Um, I, I was confused, uh, it, obviously it's the first day, but like, I think it's when you get the field research, when you complete seven stamps in a row is when you encounter a legendary Pokemon. So I don't think anybody's going to be encountering any legendary Pokemon until next weekend, until next uh, next Friday, because that's when you can get your seventh stamp. Again, it's seven stamps, one per day. 
um, but you can complete these these tasks as many as many as you want, obviously. So I'm assuming that's how Moltres is going to be released, or legendary Pokemon in general. We're going to have to find out what other legendaries are uh, in the game. But again, waiting on some news, waiting on you guys to tweet at me, waiting on news to come out, rumors and screenshots, whatever you want to call it. Um, I need to find out what's in these encounters, what Pokemon um, can be in the encounters, etc. So I'm excited. It's a really really fun system. I'm having a great time. It, it's literally another like this is a major update you guys this is another part of the game that I, I, I am enjoying you know you know there's catching and going out and having fun and playing and then there's the quest system which is absolutely amazing let me battle this espion down I gotta battle it down one time and then we can finally get this one done and I believe that's gonna be uh, one or two field research tasks and then I think another mythical one so that's gonna be good that espion just took out a grout on wow wow 100% needle king I haven't seen this guy in a couple years man nice Nice. All right, Earthquake says have the Espeon, and we got our field research done. We can go ahead and leave. I don't want to battle the next one. Let me just hop out. Oh, we got a lot of stuff rewarded. All right, we got this 1,000 XP reward. Nice. That was a task we needed to complete. Um, still need to hatch three eggs. Still need to get my candies. Now, let's claim this reward for 1,000 Stardust. I do have a star piece on, so hopefully it gives us a, a bonus, some, star, some bonus Stardust. And now, let's click the reward to get a Pokemon encounter. Uh, this was battle five gyms, so I don't know what the encounter, or encounter Pokemon encounter yeah, I guess, how do, you, how do you say that? Okay, what? what? That's what I'm gonna encounter, a freaking Machop? For doing, for battling five gyms? Okay, okay, I, I guess I'll take that. But let's spin this, let's get another field research. Let's check it, win a raid. Magikarp, let's do it. <laughs> Honestly, this was like the perfect raid to do for that kind of quest. It doesn't take long, very easily, possibly get a shiny or even a good Magikarp, you know? So, like, I definitely, definitely like this one. That's a horrible Magikarp if, I, if I'm if i correct in my head. I don't know if I am. All right, 12 balls. That would have been, been crazy. All right, let me just catch this really quick. Uh, all right, now we can go claim our reward of 1,000 Stardust. Bada bing, bada boom. Let's claim that reward right there. Let me go ahead and connect my Go Plus. Now let's go ahead and spin another Pokestop so we can unlock another field research. Um, also, we gotta go battle in a gym one time, so I'm gonna go battle that blue one right there. What's going on, guys? So because this adventure was so long, I'm gonna cut it off here, and I'm gonna have part two up very, very soon here, whether it's today or tomorrow. Um, but yeah, again, I was out for probably seven hours, six, yeah, actually like seven hours, so I had a lot of footage, way too much for one video, so I'm gonna cut it up. Hope you guys enjoyed part one of this adventure. I am now further into my stages and I think you guys are gonna get more excited as time goes on because we are getting closer and closer to Mew. So I hope you guys are excited. If you guys haven't already, make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe. Let me know how much progress you guys have made in the comments down below on your your uh, your journey to find Mew. I'm really enjoying the quest system myself. Let me know in the comments how you guys feel about it. Would you change anything? Would you like to see stuff taken away? Let me know your guys' feedback in the comments down below. I hope you guys have a great rest of the day and good luck on finding Mew.